How's it going everyone? Maryland here! That's right, it's time for another day of Animal Crossing New Leaf. Heading on over to Benchton this fine Sunday afternoon. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, trying to think what is going on. I know it's Sunday. I'm finally streaming on a Sunday again. Um, so it's gonna kind of be like a subscriber Sunday thing. Although I'm really giving it some thought and <laughs> it's really sad because once Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire are released, um, yeah, that schedule is going to change by quite a bit. So I really don't know. I'm trying to think what to do for both this week and next Sunday. Now I do have next Sunday. That's it shouldn't be any problem or anything. But um, yeah, there's still this Sunday that we can maybe have some fun with. I think last time I said that I would visit some subscribers um, Animal Crossing towns just to kind of, you know, have some fun. Um, you know, sort of a little perk of being a subscriber on Twitch. This day is sort of for you. But everyone else is of course invited to watch, which is kind of nice. Oh my goodness, I got a lot of letters. So yeah, um, what has happened? I did end up selling my turnips for that 231 that we saw Friday afternoon. Um, I don't have anything in my inventory right now because I was in the process of doing that. So let's take a look here. Dear Devin, your savings have exceeded 5 million bells. Enclosed with this letter is a special commemorative gift to express the gratitude of our entire staff. Alright, let's see what it is. I waited to see that just until, uh, just until we started up here, but I get an aluminum briefcase. Well, that's pretty cool. Um, all right, I need to get rid of some of my mail here. So let me go ahead and do that really quick because I have a lot of letters. Um, Patty, I don't think I need this. Yeah, that's a lot of money, <laughs> but it is fine. Oh, that's a cute letter. I think I'll keep that and I will keep that five million one. What's Hopper have to say? Yeah, that's really boring. <laughs> okay, let's get rid of that. And I think I only had one more left. Red's gallery. I know we don't need that. And I don't even need this Katie one either. I don't really care about keeping those. Okay, now let's see. Um, I should probably move some of this stuff around. So, I know with Subscriber Sunday, you know, we can do all sorts of different things. Looks like the internet's cooperating, which is great. Um, I don't know exactly what I want to do, but I do know I want to play maybe 30 minutes to an hour or so of Animal Crossing before we decide what to do for Subscriber Sunday proper. But anyway, that's not the only letter I got from the post office. <laughs> Dear Devin, at this time, your savings have exceeded 10 million bells. We've included a commemorative item to express our gratitude for your continued patronage. That's right. I managed to get up to 12 million bells after, um, ooh, post office poster, <laughs> after selling my turnips. It was great. 231 each. That was pretty darn good. Okay, so Kitty, my dear Devin, sorry for barging my way in the other day. Please take this with my apologies. You already have everything you need, so it's time to focus on what you want. You'll enjoy it, Kitty. Okay, what will I enjoy? Here, let's see. Really? Seriously? Kitty? Wow, um, okay, wow, that is, um, really amazing, <laughs> uh, wow, I think I'm going to sell, or uh, save this letter, <laughs> like, for a million years, holy smokes, a throne, wow, I wish I could say this is the first time that's ever happened to me, but that actually happened in my town of, um, Waffles as well. Now, I'm not actually going to do this. I'll show you another place to um, just kind of show you what I got my hands on here. But just as an example, just in case you're not entirely sure what this throne is all about. <laughs> You're paying a lot for these. Yeah, you're reading that correctly. 400,000 bells if I wanted to sell this. And that's because I guess furniture is being like it's a premium item today yeah these are literally worth eight hundred 
thousand bells. Kitty, I love you. Oh my goodness. I need to go give her like the hugest hug ever because she deserves it. Man, let me just check out TIY here and look at the catalog. I'm holding off on all my other letters um, because like this is just beyond lucky. My goodness. Oh my goodness. Now I'm not going to sell that, but if that were to ever pop up in the shop, which I've never seen it pop up in the shop. Uh, where did it go? Let's see. <laughs> wow. Uh, so it's literally worth 800000 and Kitty just gave it to me because she's rich? I don't know. It's I guess when you make 12 million bells, you know, your friends, they have to start giving you better stuff. <laughs> that must be it. Oh, well. I, you know what? Kitty, you are forever on my not ever letting you go list. You are, you're the best. Like, oh my goodness, seriously. Okay, um, here you go. Since you came over, I've been thinking that I should pay more attention to how I decorate my home. As you provided the motivation, I'm providing you with a present. Thanks again, Lucy. I'm not going to judge, but I just, I'm, I, I don't think you could top that. A milk case? Oh, thanks. Who would have thought Kitty would have given that? Um, stop me, Devin. I just couldn't help myself. It was all just so cute. I'm talking about me over shopping again. The only thing I, or the only thing to do is share with you. Take this away before I can't let it go. It's so cute. Gabby. Yeah, that sounds like Gabby, all right. All right, what did she get that's so cute? Let's see. Um, a white cap. That's pretty cool. I think I'll stick to my top hat right now. See, here's what it is. Friday, Kitty wanted me to change my clothes. She didn't like my DJ look. So you know what? I did. I changed to this. And I must have looked just so official because it was just enough to cause her to send me a throne. Man. Oh, that's so crazy. But yeah, in Waffles, when um, one of my favorite, well, actually, my favorite villager over there, Gladys, when she visited my house... She just randomly gave me a throne. Oh yeah, by the way, how do you like my house? It's pretty sweet looking, right? I kind of like it. I actually like it more than I thought I would. So that's pretty cool. Um, I need to put this throne away, like, right this moment, because that's, that is great. <laughs> that is so great. Where to put it though? Oh man, I guess I could put it right next to that dude. Yeah, let's do that. All right, uh, where did that throne go? Man, that is just, that has me so jazzed. Look at that, it's so majestic. Oh, this thing's a boss. All right, well, I will definitely put that there. Wow, well, <laughs> today's a good day. Um, yeah, that's really good. Okay, uh, as for the other things, let me just put them in here for right now. Milk case, I don't really need that. But I do want to see that poster, and I also want to see this aluminum briefcase. Oh, wow, you put it on the ground. That's interesting. That's a lot of money! <laughs> I like that. I like that a lot. Oh my goodness, I need to put that somewhere. That's really cool. Um, let's see. Where should I put this poster? Maybe I should put it up over here. Let me uh, let me take a look. Man, kitty, I'm gonna be thinking about that all day. That's like the nicest gift, I tell you. Um, I could probably put a poster over here. I think a bench would be better. Flashback, kitty suggested the modern bench <laughs> that we put up just a little bit ago. So she's amazing. All right, what we got? Oh, that's nice. I like that. That's kind of cool. All right, let's put this away. Well, that's pretty good. I think I should take my tools with me, though. I just realized, oh, yeah. Klaus? Klaus? <laughs> no, why? Hello? Are you there, dearie? <laughs> hey. <laughs> well, looks like I don't have to go find Klaus. He's found me. Sorry for disturbing you, dearie. <laughs> why does he call me dearie? Oh, sorry for the surprise. I was just walking around the neighborhood, and I got the urge to say hi. Hi, how are you doing? Oh yeah, I brought you selling a pipe organ. Wow. Why is everyone getting all fancy? That sounds really good too. I don't think it's like as rare. <laughs> okay, so here I am at Deary's house. I've got to memorize all this stuff so I can copy. Er, <laughs> you didn't hear that, Deary. 
This is a pretty nice room. It's so nice I almost want to move right in. <laughs> I bet you do. Uh, it's got that special X factor that makes it stand out, like me. What special X factor are you even talking about, Klaus? Let me just spin this thing around. Please be yourself. I want to see how you actually or how you usually act in your natural habitat, dearie. Okay. Uh, you took a lot of time selecting the perfect furniture to fit your style, right, dearie? Oh man, I wish I could take a picture of the throne. Um, if you listen to Rockabilly using that bad boy, it'll get you in a dancing mood for sure. If I um, if like Kitty gave it to me while I was over. Whoa. Ah, so you have a secret room you don't want anyone to see, huh, dearie? No worries, I'm great at keeping secrets. Just the other day, I didn't tell anyone about... Oh, never mind. Oh, boy. You want to come over here, then? Yeah. Um, but I wasn't able to take, really, a picture. I mean, the letter didn't say, Oh, here, have this throne. It said... Wait. Oh, where is he? I wanted to show him... Um, my other rooms. Oh, you're over there now. I should probably get going. Deary, sorry for showing up without any notice. Next time, why don't you visit my place instead? We can have tea and fancy cakes, buddy bear. <laughs> oh, yes we can, Glaus. Let's we yes we can. I want to check out that pipe organ. That sounds sweet. Okay, now somewhere in here is the stuff I put away earlier, um, and that would be my tools. <laughs> I don't know where they went. Uh, I knew that I put them away for something. Oh, there we go. Oh, I finally got the golden axe and waffles. I felt so good about that. It's like, yay. Oh, come on. You can, you can come here. All right, there we go. Uh, white cap. I don't really need that, but whatever. Milk case. Could sell that, but I'll just hold on to it for now. It's no big deal. Is there anything else in here that I'm forgetting? No, it doesn't look like it. All right, that's fine. That's fine. Well, super jazzed about that throne. Maybe I will, you know, stop talking about it eventually. But hey, for right now, that is good news. So I need to do something extremely nice for Kitty. And I don't know what. Like, maybe I should send her that pipe organ. I know it is kind of regifting, but oh right, I wanted to look at the pipe organ. What am I doing? Come on, come on. Now, even though I had 12 mil, um just this morning actually I did end up spending about another 4.86 mil on um, uh, what was it on turnips they were going I managed to get them for 90 which is super cool that's uh, I think the lowest you can buy them at all right let's see how this thing looks oh this thing looks rad oh that's great I like that I don't know where I want to put it though but that could look really cool Ooh, I know where to put it I know where to put it. Let's put it in here. Um, yeah, I think that would fit this theme quite well. But if I just move this out of the way, move this guy. Let's call this guy Frank. I don't know. Uh, and if we put this here, like, you know, all great kind of spooky, creepy kind of things. They need a pipe organ. You know, you need to dress up like Dracula. Put a pipe organ over there. Um, I guess I could probably put my bed in this corner. I was trying to avoid doing that, but it's not really a problem. So, one bit of good news is now that I have pretty much more money than I need, <laughs> I mean, that's an understatement, and I have money invested in turnips, I could basically go wild with upgrading my house. I don't have to worry about that at all. I can spend and spend and spend. Um, so that's really good. Oh, there's one other thing that I need to show really quick here let me show you the um <laughs> this coffin i don't remember if i showed that but <laughs> it's a storage thing like you can store things in there but <laughs> there's a skeleton <laughs> like when you open it up <laughs> i love it it's so great it's so great oh i love it um let's see so read in the chat because i do do that um, any tips on getting money off the stock market? Absolutely. Um, probably the best way is to have a whole bunch of, you know, friends or browse like Animal Crossing forums or the Animal Crossing Reddit or something. Actually, I think it's AC Turnips. Um, because you want to find people that have prices that are really good. That works out well. But beyond that, oh, hey, what's going on, Pinky? I'll get back to that in a moment. 
Oh, <laughs> I just overheard these flowers gossiping about me, Sweet D. It was so mean what they said. They said I wasn't super cute. Please tell me I've still got it. I'm irresistibly cute, right? Oh, you're beyond super cute. <laughs> Talk about having skeletons in your closet. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad you see it that way, Sweet D. I'll start to second guess myself, bye. Yup. You're super cute. You know it. So, yeah, so with, um, with turnip prices, from what I've gathered, there are four main patterns. There's um, just like a random pattern. There's a constantly declining pattern where the price keeps going down and keeps going down past Thursday p.m. Like if it hasn't risen at all by Thursday p.m., sell now. That's the worst you can get. Or find somewhere else to sell. That's ideal. And then there's two sort of spike patterns. And they start as just constantly declining, but then one day, all of a sudden, the price will start to increase. And then if it increases again, depending on how much it increases, um, freshwater goby season. I don't know where to get one of these, but I would assume it's in the fresh water. <laughs> okay, um, yeah. I'll find him one. I'll at least try. I haven't gotten one, so... Yeah. Um, but you want to watch for that. Once you start to see that, don't sell it immediately because the price will increase at least three times. So remember the price of turnips, there's the AM price, and then once it changes past 12 uh, or noon, then it switches to a PM price. So you actually get two prices every day, which is kind of nice. Um, the only thing you have to just keep in mind is if it goes past Thursday and you don't see the price increase if it's not done by Thursday p.m. if you're keeping track and I recommend keep track by the way that's what I've been doing I've been monitoring it on both of my towns which is good it gives me uh, quite a few options actually which I like but yeah um that's what I recommend for turnips oops um well, I guess I don't need that all right, so people keep saying, forgot the shovel. I have the shovel right here. I didn't forget it. I was just holding it when I was in my house. Um, so I, I'll have to find that freshwater goby later. There's some other things I want to do. Like, I need to give my greatest thanks to Kitty for her ever awesome magnificence. <laughs> I should probably put, like, a really cool public works project next to her. I think that would be a great tribute. Um, all the fruit I've been eating has been feeling good. I want some fruit? Oh, sure, I'll give her some fruit. Do, 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 do. Oh, here's some fruit. Oh, did I just trample some flowers? Wow, what a jerk I am. Okay, let's shake this, and I'll just give her some peaches. Why not? Why not? Do, 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 do. Okay, so, good news about... The path. I mean, I don't have the... Uh, oh, wow. <laughs> Look at this. Something here is a fake. And as much as you would think it's this one, I think it's actually this one. Yep. There we go. Nice. A ruby. I can put that on some pank stuff. Um, oh, a gyroid. Right. I guess it did kind of rain for a little bit yesterday. Oh, weird. I don't like gyroids, though. But yeah, so I almost have the sewing machine unlocked for a quiet. That's the main reason that I don't have a QR code for any of these new paths available is because I did those on my second character, Quiet, and I haven't really done anything, um, you know, at the time I made them, as far as the sewing machine went. Like, I've been meaning to, but I didn't have it at that time. So that's kind of what my current project is. I am working on it. Man, there's a lot of... <laughs> there's a lot of these dig spots here, huh? Oh, well, that's fine. Oh, right. I should probably go back and deliver that fruit, huh? Ah, darn it. I was hoping it wouldn't be a bamboo shoot. Shoot. Okay, um, do, do, do. Let's go ahead and eat that. Yum. All right. I don't know why I keep eating those. They're tasty, of course. All right. Wow, look at all these dig spots. This is crazy. Oh, well, it's fine. Oh, no, there goes the balloon. I could have actually hit it with uh, ooh, a mega quasoid. That sounds pretty cool. I could have hit it with my 
net if it went over the cliff, but oh well. I don't really care. For some reason, I don't like the balloon stuff all that much. I know I need to get it, but... Eh. Oh, well. Um... Yeah, I brought it. <laughs> Devin, you look like you're digging this. I totally dig it. <laughs> oh, that's great. Okay, let's see. Oh, it looks delectable. Yes. That's a taste I've been craving. I should take your prism tea. Sweet. Thank you, Devin. Oh, you're welcome. Um, actually, you know what? While I'm here, let me just see if this is the money slash gem rock. No, but there's a pill bug there. Pillsbury dough bug. What? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, let me grab... Oh! <laughs> it's not a mushroom. It's a mush table. Yes. And it has a mushroom to store things. Do, 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 do. Oh, man. I can't even go over there. See, I don't know why they call this game Animal Crossing if you can't cross all the time. But, oh well, it's fine. Whoops. There we go. Hmm. Hmm. So I need to get a fish. Oh, let me check on my flowers. In fact, that's right. I seem to recall there being an extra black rose. I don't remember if I had two or if I just had the one. But whatever the case. Oh, where is Kitty anyway? I don't see her at her house. She must be out and about. Hmm. Well, I'll give her something really neat. I don't know what. And I think I should also build a public works project nearby because, um, you know, she's worth it. She deserves it. Kind of nice. Ooh, all my perfect peaches are ready too. That's awesome. Um, do, 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 do. Hey, Patty. Oh, what, what's going on, Patty? Didn't I hear you say you wanted a waffle shirt? Oh, sure. Thanks. <laughs> Man, everyone's being so generous today. Aw, I think of it as proof of our, of our friendship. Aw, I wouldn't throw it away. I'd at least sell it. Oh, yay, they're talking. I love it when animals talk. I just bought this uber cute outfit. Don't you absolutely adore it? The second I saw your outfit, I was all like, I have got to get myself an outfit just like that. What are they doing? <laughs> it looks like they're smooching or something. Uh, <laughs> I know, I saw this look on the cover of Today's Stylish Cow and I just had to get it. Oh my gosh, I totally read that issue. How did I not notice your outfit like right away? Hey, I guess I must wear it a lot better than the cover model. Can you guess where I got my new outfit from? Did you get it from that awesome pinky sassy style catalog by any chance? Oh, there's Kitty. <laughs> I totally wish there was a catalog like that. I would buy all my outfits from it. Wait a sec. Is there a catalog like that? I think someone's been using my name illegally. <laughs> oh my goodness, these two are hilarious. <laughs> Calm down. There's no catalog like that. Although I think we all agree there should be. Are you pulling my leg? I'm like so totally confused right now. <laughs> that was amazing. I just love their totally random conversations. It's just like the best thing. And I need to go track Kitty down, darn it. Oh, well, I'll do it from this side. Yeah, another fossil. Oh, what? I can't carry anything more. Man, my inventory fills up fast. Well, you know what? I'm going to... Oh, right. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Nice. Nice. That's rather peachy, I guess you could say. Okay, dug up a fossil. I think I have the two black roses going on over here, sort of by my bench. Yeah, look at that. I'm hoping that they will make more little baby roses. <laughs> okay, let's see. Do, 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 do. There we go. Hopefully those will spread a little bit. I'll do some more watering later, I guess. Um, but I just want to make sure I didn't forget about that. Okay, I should probably take some things to, um, well, no, 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 hold up, hold up. First and foremost, where is Kitty? I need to find her. I need to thank her. Aw, oh, she's fishing. Surprised to see me fishing? Good. I like to keep people on their toes for her. <laughs> I just love how she's staring at the camera when she says that. It's like, wait, you're not even looking at me. You're just looking right at you. <laughs> oh, that's so good. 
Um, I guess I'll wait until she's done. There was something I wanted to do. I want to see what kind of public works projects we can put nearby her house. I feel like she deserves something. Um, I can't think of what. Maybe a modern bench. Maybe I should put a bench near her house. Hey, you. How's it going, Isabel? Um, how satisfied is everyone? Yeah, that's right. Viva Benchton. So great. Okay, let's see. Um, need a new cool public works project. Oh, let's see. Now I have money. I should really do one of these, but at the same time, I really feel like I should give Kitty something. So, I don't know. I could give her a fountain. I could give her this thing. I could give her that bench. A flower arch. Ooh, that'd be nice. I could put a custom design sign and make a throne there. She'd probably like that. I'll give her a flower clock. I know I already have a flower clock in town, but they're nice. The animals like them. Although I guess I could do that, or... I don't know, these arches are really nice. Maybe I should take a look at giving her an arch, or maybe a fairy tale clock. I don't know, I just want to do something nice. Modern bench. Nah, you know what, I'll save that for later. I think these flower arches. Wait, that's right, I never made a flower arch here, did I? I think I meant to. But I didn't wind up doing that. I have one over on Waffles. Well, these just look so nice no matter where you put them. So I'm going to see if I can find a place that's relatively close to Kitty's house. Let's see. Um, I have a feeling this is going to be too close, but maybe if I move back one more. Like right here? <laughs> it's really darn close. Let's see, um, yeah, a little too close. Uh, I could maybe chop down this lovely, perfect peach tree, but Kitty is worth it. Alright, what about right here? Is this far back enough? Oh, uh, yes, this would be perfect. Okay, what will it look like? Alright, that's kind of nice. I think that's great. But the only thing is, before I do that, I think it's going to cut down this tree here. So I'm, oop, right. <laughs> oh, nice try. Okay, let me put away um, some things in the mail really quick. Do, do, do. Well, I guess I only need three, huh? <laughs> okay, that's fine. Um, oh no, I guess I did need four. Oh, well, I can, I can work it. I can work it. All right, let's see. I just need to put this right there. That there. And let's talk to Isabel once more. Will cost me a perfect peach tree, but it's really no problem. Because um, I think that she deserves this. Look at that. That's nice. That's nice. All right, that'll be Kitty's flower arch. Okay, and I know I have a lot of money for that, which is great. Um, oh, it feels so barren without the tree there, but it's fine. It's fine. Okay, where is Kitty at? Are you still fishing, Kitty? Where are you? Hey, you. Hey, you. Here you are again, Devin. You really get around, don't you? Was there something you wanted? Um, let's talk. So, Devin, the rumor is that your home is looking very nice right now. <laughs> I'd like to come over and see it for myself, Devin. Yes. Uh, oh, what time's good for you? Oh, wait, I've got a date with some tasty pasta salad. So I'll have to be after 5. Okay, we really do owe it to her. At least she's not saying, like, 5.30. So we got to stick around until 5 before we can do too much else. Um, let's see. Now, I do see in the chat someone saying, have I ever considered live streaming Skyrim? I think I talked about this either in the last episode or the episode before. Um, no. I have no plans on live streaming that, simply because it's much too mature for my audience, like my target audience. Like, 
one cool thing about Maryland videos is, you know, you watch them and you know that they're going to be generally appropriate, um, you know, for any age. So playing a game like Skyrim really is not appropriate for younger children to be watching, especially if they're expecting, you know, Maryland quality. So for that reason, I will not be streaming Skyrim or playing it on any of my channels because it's rated M and that's just not, it's not appropriate. Now that's not to say I don't enjoy Skyrim, just so that's clear. It's not to say that I don't enjoy Skyrim because I do. Uh, it is fun. Um, I just, I don't want to, uh, <laughs> I'm going to close my eyes and guess what you want for your birthday. You already gave me a throne. Ah, I wish I have a good time. Is that right? Well, do you think it'll come true? Yes, I think so. All right. I'd like to think that I helped play some f small part in your success. Aw. Okay, there we go. There we go. Um, let's see. So that's really good news. Anyway, I think I should probably head on down to Main Street, see what they got for sale there, and, um, yeah, examine these fossils. So let's go for this.